Hey everybody, Sam back once again, and yes, in today's video, we're going to show you how to root your Samsung Galaxy 4 running Android 4.4.2. Now, you can use this for previous versions and for other devices, but primarily today, I'm going to show you on my Galaxy 4, which is running 4.4.2 on a stock ROM. Now, I'm using Mac for this video, but this video is actually aimed at Windows users. So yeah, if you're running a Mac, you need to get Parallels or VM Fusion, VMware Fusion. Um, I recommend Parallels, it's my personal favourite. Do a quick look on it, see if you want to get it. You can get a trial version, so if you don't want to buy it, you can just get a trial version. But yeah, it, this is made for Windows based users. So anyway, let's get on with the video. There's two links in the description. Now the two links, one of them is for C off Auto Root, that's the main file. But the second is for the Samsung drivers. So, first of all, what I want you to do, as you can probably see on screen, go to the first link, C off Auto Root, download it. Now that's in a zip file. I need you to extract that file. Now, very straightforward. I have something like WinRAR or just extract it. It's very straightforward. Second of all, download the tools and SDK, which is the Samsung USB drives for mobile phones. Again, this link is down below. Download it, install it. You might need to reboot your computer. If you do reboot it, then come back. Obviously, come back to the part of the video where we are now. Um, and at that point, you want to open up the folder that you've created or you've got for CF Auto Root. Within that folder, you have these three files. The first one is an MD5 file. The second one, it just looks like a text file. I think it's configuration settings. Don't worry about it. And the last one is Odin 3 version 1.85. You should have all those three. Right, all we're gonna do now is actually go to our phone. So make sure your phone's turned off. Now when your phone's turned off, press the volume down, the home button and the power button. Again, that's volume down, the home button and the power button. So press the volume down and the, and the home button first, and then followed by the power button. So press and hold all three together. Your phone should give you like a little vibration. And at this point, you should have this. So on your screen, hopefully you can see that says warning. At this point, I'm gonna give you my disclaimer. I'm not responsible for you breaking your device, for you voiding your warranty, all that kind of malarkey. If you do this, it's on your own back. So you put volume up to continue or volume down if you want to cancel. So if you're not too sure, you're thinking, I'm a bit of a girl, press volume down. If you want to carry on, like I'm going to do, and press volume up. So press volume up. At this point, you should have, as you can see there, a little Android guy, and it says downloading. Do not turn off target. So at the moment, just put your phone down. What I want you to do then is open up Odin 1.85. So I've got a copy of it opened up here. So it should look like that. At this point, I want you to use your USB, your micro USB, and connect it to your device. So just plug your device in, like so. At this point, um, you should see it's got like a little yellow and it says COM4. Yours might say COM1, COM2, COM3, COM4, 5, 6. It could say any number. As long as it's yellow, we're good to go and we're connected. Now at this point, you want to click on the PDA section. So that's PDA. Click on that. Then what you want to do is locate where them three files were. So wherever you extracted the CF Auto root, you need to go to that folder. Now within that folder, there's only one of them you can open up and it's the MD5 file we spoke about first of all. So click on that, click open, we're good to go. At this point, you can't click anything else. Auto reboot's already ticked for you and you can't take any other ones. So all we need to do now is click start. You ready for it? Let's click start. So now on the phone and on the computer, you should see like a little progress bar so you can see on the actual phone there, and on the computer, your little progress bar is just gone, and boom, it says pass. That's it. Your phone is almost rooted. So it looks like my phone's about to reboot. It's actually not going to reboot. It's actually going to start rooting the actual device now. You see a little red Android logo. This is all down to Chainfire. Big props to Chainfire. This is now fully rooting your device. So it's going to do its thing, let it go through, and it's going to turn your device back on. When it's turned on, you are fully rooted. Now, hopefully we're going to hear the uh, wonderful Samsung music in about five seconds or so. Maybe five, four, three, two, one. Let me down, Samsung. How could you do this to me? And here, you go. here it comes. Yeah, that's getting a bit old now. Change it up. <laughs> so, your device is going to turn on. You're fully rooted, which I will show you as well. Um... So it says Android is upgrading, starting apps. So just get into your device, 
go to apps, side to right, side swipe, and boom. As you can see there, I have got super user SU, which now means your device is fully rooted. You can unplug it. You could have unplugged it before now, but unplug it if you've not already. And that's it. You're fully rooted in your Galaxy S4. How simple was that? Now, what do you reckon to these style of videos? Do you want me to carry on this kind of video or do you want me to not do these videos again? If you want me to do more, then please hit the like button. It really does help. And subscribe if you want more of these kind of videos. But mainly, leave them a comment down below. Tell them what you think of this kind of video. Again, it's the first I've done in a while of kind of rooting a device. Um, and it's a different kind of style as well. Do you like this style? Or do you want me to go back to just a basic kind of normal style that I've done in the past? Again, let me know in a comment down below or hit me up on Twitter at Sam J. Pullum. If you've got any questions about this whatsoever, there is like a little tech list to follow down below in the description as well. It's exactly what I've done, to you, uh, done today, but you can read it as well as follow the video. Anyway, people, I appreciate you watching this one. As I said, please hit the like button and subscribe for more videos, all that kind of stuff. Anyway, I'm going to get off. Thanks for watching and you'll see me very, very shortly. Cheers, everyone.